Hillary Clinton said in a new interview that it pained her to go to Donald Trump's inauguration, especially when she had so much hope for the presidency. Watch here. Nobody was more upset to see Donald Trump inaugurated than Hillary Clinton. On a visit to the Ellen Show on December 15, Hillary told host Ellen DeGeneres that she understandably wasn't looking forward to seeing her political opponent officially become president on January 21, and didn't want to go to the ceremony. In fact, she and husband Bill Clinton tried their hardest to get out of the obligation. Unfortunately, it's political protocol as a former president to attend their successor's inauguration. Bummer. Honestly, we tried to get out of it, she told Ellen. But we called Jimmy Carter, we called the Bushes. The elder Bushes were in the hospital so they didn't have to go, Ellen quipped that the Bushes, George H.W. Bush, and Barbara Bush, who are in their 90s and both fell suddenly ill at the same time, were lucky. Sick burn. Hillary said that she, and the former presidents, all wanted Trump to succeed, that no matter who the president is, you want to see them be able to do a good job for the country. I went to the inauguration with that hope, she said. And it was a painful and disappointing experience. Same dot she said that writing her new memoir, What Happened, was an emotional experience, as well. Looking back on the presidential election and writing about her loss especially after learning it wasn't all her fault made her desolate. It was so painful. I'd literally have to write and go lie down. It was so painful, she told Ellen. Do you think the Clintons should have skipped Trump's inauguration? Or did they really need to go? Let us know.